Shit. Out of sight from and after Usually, her and her it's fine. Exactly. Whether it's right or wrong. We get home, we celebrate. But this time you two never did. He needs me. I must go. I could come with you. I'm retracing our steps. It's too far without an ikran. I can search here. Maybe he and Zomir... I literally turned it off and back on. That's all I did. He has a place at the stone pillars down the hill from here. There's a cave at the bottom of the cliffs. Like I said, I turned it off and back on. The sky people move in backs. And save yourself broken bones by using the big... Yo, appreciate it, cuz. You've been a day one, you know what I'm saying? You wear some strange clothes. No, I literally did not fucking do anything, but okay. My dick is out. Fuck. Said something about wanting to watch the sky people and see them. Yo, yo. Your kids are around. That's just weird, bro. Ah. What card, bro? Shield, shield rates? The one where you lose two life every time you draw a card? Golly! Not over there! Damn, that bitch actually listened. She ran across to the other end of the bed. What the fuck? Some, some intelligent ass cats, I guess. Wow. I'll yell at you whenever you want, cuh. I'm in the tree! Fuck off! Ah! How the fuck are you? Dead. Dead. Oh, you didn't see me deck, bro. Literally just decked that man. What the fuck do a shadow sport do? Oh, they explode. I could have, uh, I could have shot those and made them blow up on them. Hmm. Interesting. Oh yeah. Shit is pristine. Do what again? Pulled the nut off. Basket. Oh, these fuckers got waxed. Doesn't look, look right. I'm not be fought with RDA. Not maybe it's linked to 
his abilities expand further. While rolling an egg, Billy becomes slightly Does faster look right? with more agility, and the player is able to have him perform a few new moves with the egg, like egg dunking, Does look slamming, right? dashing, and shooting. Are we sure that these eggs are really okay when they hatch? They uh, take quite the beating, honestly. Anikran fought in this cave. Its headpiece snapped in the struggle, like Katamari, clawed its way out. Grows over time as you roll it around and use it to help defeat enemies, traverse the levels, and gather fruit until it hits its peak limit and gives you the glowing signal that it's ready to hatch. Egg growth rate can vary. They're all unique, and it has a lot of fun to the game overall. Then you hit it with your signature rooster call, and bada bing, bada boom, you've hatched. But whatever the heck comes out, it could be an animal, or it can be items, or even some other surprises that I'll get into. You don't have to help hatch each egg in the game, but there are eggs that are necessary to do so in helping you get through the level. I mean, come on, imagine being called Billy Hatcher, and you can't even live up to your last name. But life for the Hatcher and his eggs aren't as simple as it seems. The eggs themselves can be damaged, cracked, and fully destroyed without the prize inside, if you're not careful. So be mindful of how you're taking down enemies and tackling the level's landscape in general. Luckily, eggs can re spawn back where you originally found them, so they aren't lost forever, and you just have to start over with your progress. To get through the game, you'll go through seven worlds that all have a bunch of missions in them each to earn emblems that will ultimately be your ticket to having enough courage in the ending battle against Dark Raven. So before I break a few more things down, let's get into the story of the game to help better understand but what the else? heck is going on here. <laughs> Start your adventure in Morningland, which is filled with two stopped here. Nice Someone or something interrupted him before he could eat. Itu landed with his Ikran Somme. They fought the RDA, they got trapped in the cave but escaped up there. Is that Ikran blood? A set trail to follow. RDA, I'd better hurry. Oh damn, is this a main story quest? Where's your weak spot at, bro? Oh, there it is. Shit. Shit. Gotcha. Thank you for these gifts. Was not a clean kill. Tragic. No, 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 no. I heard her. That way. Oh, where all the fire and destruction is. Okay. Oh, 
How the turntables turn tables? Oh, fuck it. Fuck. What's <laughs> so funny, dickhead? Uh, combat suits hurt. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh, did your turntables turn tables, guy? Ho! Oh, sniper! <laughs> Bro said that shit hurt a bit. Yo, that is it. You guys wanna fucking play? We can fucking play! Ow, 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 fuck. Fuck shit, fuck. Okay, fine, I'll put away the fucking AR, damn it. Back to the bow. Oh my god, that was dirty. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck. You were playing dinosaurs. I'm destroying man of dorks all day. Did you play the man of dorks that says use this mana to cast a dinosaur creature or activate a dinosaur's ability? Oh, you play your frog? What the fuck?
shiny. I refuse. Yeah, I'm in a game for the cookies. I'm riding around on a big lizard. But don't get it twisted. Munkip's not a lizard. Why are you inside of being called Munkip? You're a dick. I cannot wait till dinos aren't in fucking standard anymore. And then you just don't have a dick. Shut the fuck up. Hold on, I'll try and fix it. Storm actually launched as a free to play title in September and is available to download right now for free on PC or any console. My sister is a huge Disney fan and we love playing racing games together. So it's so cool that she can download this game for free and we can play cross No power. Whenever we want. I'll try to reconnect it. Play another racing game that we love together. And season five of Disney Speedstorm is officially here and is fully inspired by the film Frozen. That means Trying to let you out. Maika, Zome, is she still fighting? She helped me fight off the RDA. The sky people separated. Cornered me in here. I could hear them shooting at me. No. No. We should get out of here before more comes. I must get to her. I know. Four times 
weaknesses. But I have to see what this looks like. We can always unfuse these two and then fuse the oxys with something else later. But look at it! That's it! No, this is it. That should work! Cool. Let's get out of here! Silly. The chandelier base on the deoxys is ridiculous. <laughs> That was too close. Now, are you you really have my thanks, Sailor and I. It was so many who saved us. It must be a legend. <laughs> really now we're ready Together, we fear nothing. I, know your game you got I saw that little tear shoot her as she tore it down. I shall go now and tell it to her what she missed. You're injured. Let me help you. Just nothing. I shall call Zome and be on my way. Reggie Gigas shed ninja with a wonder guard. <laughs> I thought Reggie Gigas was going to be way more difficult than it turned her. out to be. But either she way, she can't be far. Zome is strong and brave. We will find her. Yeah, Zomi's dead. I'm not born with Saturn. I do not know how it is. Tell me. I'm going to have no other. Fly as one. I hope to have a bond with you and Zomi one day. Are you way you are. That is my I'm deepest hope for this too. I think I heard that. That way. This thing being a steel type how did you choose this? She chose me. Reggie Gigas was a lot of fun to see. She trusted me. Now I am. She's tiny. It's so adorable. Get through. We should stop. Let's see what's going on in Mount oh, Moon. Uh, I Zome think it's needs me. Any ah. starter we can catch is probably going to get some pretty cool fusions. You keep hey, looking for her. Try and find her scent. I will catch up. Rock? Are you kidding me? There we go. We can start stacking some cool Pokemon. Once we get a legendary, we'll be ready to fuse. What? I thought I'd seen every Pokemon in this cave. That's incredible. Let's go. Genesect has to have the coolest possible fusions. 17 Pokeballs. But that one premiere ball, the guaranteed. Come on, come on. There it is, the old BM7. What did you do? Quick, I found her. That's what I'm talking about. Hi, Team Rocket. What do you got for me? Good job. What are you doing down there, buddy? Triple fusion? Wait a minute, what? Am I going to be able to triple fuse three legendaries at some point? Mama. I need to find out. Let's see what this is. What have they done to you, my beautiful? Wait a second. Golurk is in I this am here fusion. now. Golurk is one of the best Pokemon to Let me carry your pains on me. Oh, that's so exciting. And there Let me help you. Genesec and Golurk could create one of the We have to go home, Zomi. You have to fight so we can go home together. Like. You are not fighting. It's not as cool as some of the other supposed to. I've seen, I'll be honest. A little disappointed. Not leave you know me. This is what we're using. Wait, Please. What? I didn't even realize it was going to evolve. I forgot they could evolve. Gregory. No. I'm sorry. Gregory. Oh my god, that's so cool. We can wait, save her, wait can't a we? second. I can use the shiny sprite even though it's not shiny. Yeah, I'd Return like to, to Eowyn. Before we unleash the true power 
of Gregory on the water, Jim. I need a bit of a water break of my own. But Until whispering winds lift era, us once I more. Videos without having my water bottle by my side, and it's the reason I've been drinking way more water every single day. Arab has just made drinking water more fun, as I absolutely love trying out all of the different I was too late, Hector. It's fully replaced I'm using so any sorry. artificial flavoring. Please, in my if water, there's anything I can do. Really to and the best part of all is air up is super so easy to use. You just must be choose honest. a flavor, put the scent Perhaps on, we can on your do it together and once I return to you. My absolute favorite scent I'll give you some time is orange around. vanilla swirl, and I would love to show it off and put it on my water bottle, but my fiance's little sister took my last one when she visited me. Fair. I did gift her an air up water bottle and a few scent pods as air up's really the perfect gift. Everyone you know drinks water and air up makes it a tasty experience that's good for their own health. So gift with taste this holiday season with air up. Click the link in the description to check out the limited edition bundles. Perfect for gift giving and save up to 30%. Don't need anything else. Crab Tios. <laughs> You want to get me more coffee? Zap 
Crypto-Sade. I think that's the saying. That's what I'm talking about! The ultimate weapon I always dreamed it could be. Now we're ready to take on Surge. All right, Surge. Give me your best shot. You see me rolling. Man just squashed Lugia into a ball and thought no one would notice. You can't do that. Put it in reverse, man! Volkia. First Pokemon is a Lugia into a circle. This time, it's a circle into a Lugia. I, I never know what to expect from you, Surge. Electro Lugia? Gone. What's that final Lugia surge? I should have known, just like we all expected. Clean sweep by Goku. Let's see what legendary we're going to be going against next. Wait a second. Oh, no. Rayquaza. Oh, my God. Going to need some pretty good fusions for this one. We have a few cool options in the box. Anything that's going to help us take on a Rayquaza, so... I just want to see what's in the grass. What do we got for fusions? Fallen luck. What? It should be where Nao saw that lone ride? human. There's no way! The bigger question, though, is do we keep this guy? Or but do what we else? use both of them with a different legendary we have? As much as I love Goku, it was always meant to be one gym battle before we this thing was something I don't think else. So. And I think I know just the Pokemon. We saw a lot of Someone Lugia from the resistance was here. Like I didn't see Not cool RDA. One. I'm gonna give it one more good. shot because ground flying's a pretty good typing. Oh my god! I That's wonder so if sick. what Goku was something special. But I think Goku is ready to take its place. Fast. But now we have a really big So fast they dropped their tab. I wonder what if legendary do we use with Dark Whoever was here this could be pretty crazy. They kicked it. Hey, yeah. It's full. Did you do two of them? Let's see. Thank you. A resistance human flew here to work on something. And kick the tree. Frustrated, maybe? Tablet could have more. First trainer battle with Rayquaza fusions. I'm honestly pretty excited. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I do not like this. Wait. Oh, that is incredible. I love the colors on this thing. I love that it's like holding the tiny sword and the tiny shield. Come on, Mammoth Swine's incredible. And this is what you give me? This? I did not catch one, but that's what you have for Mammoth Swine? What is this? Because so we can all like go in here? Let's see what we can Lay down, Baba Booey. I still think the chosen one needs to be a little bit more chosen. That's what I'm talking and about! Zekrom and the Electric Iris. Plant, that's exactly what we need. Smile. There we go! It's time for a new it's... beginning. Moo Moo on the Zekrom, that's what all the kids are saying. Smile, oh, right? we got it. Ah. That right there is actually so pretty stupid. darn cool. This fusion even makes sense. Mind. It's got the electric yeah, tail that's yeah. powering up the cannon, making it even stronger. I'm really starting to love the team we're putting together. Time to get to the game. I'm not teaching Flash to one of my Pokemon. What? Are you angry that I'm not teaching Flash you to a Pokemon? Sorry. Do you want to learn Hello. Flash? I don't know why you showed up after I said that. Now we got a legendary chilling in the box. Waiting for a rainy day when we need a new incredible fusion. What is this? This is one of the coolest fusions we've seen yet. Wow. That's just so fun. Every spherical fusion was... needs to have a Pokemon huh. painting a portrait. Come on. I we thank you. For these I get gifts. out of the cave and now I'm in like a freaking alien predator movie. What is this? This thing is terrifying. If I'm correct, I actually need to go in here before I can progress. What an insane thing to say. You can at least make them faint? Oh, your Pokemon don't look dead. I can at least make them faint. Um, uh, and then you send this out. Are you kidding me? Raydeen. Is that really going to be Rayquaza Goldeen? Yes. Doug, I hate you. Whoa. That has no business being as cool as it is. It was really cool. It just wasn't good. Yes, we figured it out. Finally. Okay. Did you say you tore out Tangela's mind? What is happening here? I just want to battle and see what the next legendary on the wheel is going to be. I don't know if I have time for all this. Wait a minute, Erica. Rayquaza Sylveon is kind of terrifying. Could you not have that for the gym battle, please? Whoa. Wait a second. That thing looks like Walking Wake, doesn't it? There's no way that's a coincidence. There's no way. I feel like there shouldn't be a machine that I can access that just floods the sewers. I'm now drowning this man. I'm responsible for this. I need to leave. Hey, Giovanni. I'm not worried about a bat Rayquaza. That's not a big deal at all. Ooh, Raybat. Why are all your Pokemon 
just bad. This is a horrible strategy. That is actually the perfect Pokemon for the evil boss. It's not busy. Rest. Just so? No, it's just that. I'm not sure who to talk to about this. I don't know how long. Uh, sure. yeah, uh, it's finally time for the fourth It's gym. okay. You can tell me, Jin. Nervous, okay. Ray Thanks. <laughs> it's Danny. Still a dragon type. That's perfect. Not worried about the scary face. And there's the paralysis. They're gonna waste some healing. That is the best possible start. We got a good chance. Rune Quaza. That's actually a threat. Sky Shock. You seem more I settled. A lot of damage for not very Making effect, the best of things. Gregory, this is your moment to prove your king of Did the Did you Ray add Quaza. more decorations? The Addy A won't swim for that. And then the crunch to finish it off. Ray Poke. Here you go. Have a look. Ray Poke. <laughs> we went against a lot of incredible Ray Quaza fusions, and this is all you, you take can care muster of yourself. up. Come on, Will. Ooh. If every Deoxys fusion is a different form with a different stats, this can get pretty chaotic pretty quickly. Between Delkia and Roger, I think the team's actually Message. pretty ready Choose to take care. on Deoxys fusions. Jonathan's been a little bit disappointing, and I think we should try this. I am ready. Come on. <laughs> that's Galarian Zapdos, but I think cooler. Oh, I think that's what we need. Hey, very, very cool. Do not Are be you caught okay? off guard. Are you a zombie? <laughs> that's the demon haunting you? I can't help you with that. Uh, that's that's way above my pay grade. That thing is terrifying. Yo, Dial. <laughs> Sticking at your yeah. <laughs> Look at the wagon on this one. <laughs> This looks drastically Maybe different, but I bet there's something cool in here, and there is Macham! It's one of my favorite Pokemon of all time. We're absolutely getting this thing. Probably not good to fuse it while we're going against Deoxys. Eventually, we're gonna need a fighting type. I think is it that... might be time to take on Koga. You here still have Mercer's walkie-talkie. Oh, come on, that can't be it what you lead with, Koga. You gotta hit me with something better than that. I just like having it, okay? That. You just gotta. Don't so make so a big deal out of it. I'm not. Uh, uh, I'm surprised. Never mind. That's all. Eogar, okay. <laughs> I know things. I don't imagine the next legendary will be, be a bit tough. tougher than the Oxus. Just. No, 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 it's no, how no, I used to. We don't have Arcus, to get rid of on. everything they yes. get. Mercy. <laughs> I'm a rushy ram. The team's starting to look incredibly cool, but I don't want to get too yeah, your bitch ass is gonna betray you. Create the perfect fusion, and then just give over an opportunity to have some fun and create a bunch of different fusions. I got a lot of Pokemon in the Safari Zone. I will catch everything in this grass. We also got some legendaries, so you know what? Legendary. Hey, what do you got for me? I'm starting off a little silly. A tablet I found, <laughs> dropped by one of our people. This could make do you think you can fix it? Whoa. Ouch. Wish I could say like yes. But what this tablet needs is a prayer, not a scientist. This is where we get you said it belongs to someone in the resistance? Yeah, a human based on the boot prints I found nearby, and female judging from the audio recording I snagged from it. They made a point to record in privacy, away from HQ. A human female. Well, that narrows it down. <laughs> Good luck. We were so close to losing everything. Thankfully, Pandora will heal. But now I have a golden opportunity. I have waited for this moment for way too long. I didn't know if I'd be able to do it in this playthrough, but here we are. That's what I'm talking about! Look at this sprite and tell me that Kabutops is not meant to evolve into Genesis. Have you been out in the rainforest yeah, recently, really Nalene? How am I supposed to yes, this actually. Cool I was at a field lab just earlier. Just got back to HQ. Right, Did you drop anything on the way back? <laughs> Gear or tech, perhaps? Oh, my God. oh no. I travel very light. The field lab That's has everything I need. The fewer things on me means fewer sick. chances to be forgetful. Ooh. So, no I'm time to record about. poetry, I guess. There time for go. poetry? This is the Never mind. Thing. Have you seen Danny anywhere? At the field lab. You have to find the other. There's not that many beta Pokemon for the third generation Pokemon. But this is a famous one. The three heads of Hydreigon could be awesome. <laughs> what? Raikou with just a storm cloud of Hydreigon following it? in its wake electric type with levitate i think we might need this one on the team there's something about going against reshiram with a really cool you were right 
of that table. Well, I'm glad I let feels right. Any idea who might own that broken tap? They went out to exactly what I was looking for. Oh, that attack stat is absurd. Reckoning, Gregory, the chosen one, Dalkia, Haiku, and Gokia. I feel pretty good about this squad of six. I think it's time to take on the next gym. I should have known. Time to take out the trash. What do you got? Anka, Whoa, have you been out in the rainforest recently? Team Rocket's gonna have well, yeah. This cool I'm a pilot. Might be a I go nightmare. out all the time. Gotta keep an eye on those like RDA patrols, you know? Wow, Any chance you dropped way. a piece of Mega gear or a tech the last time you went out? What? what are you doing here? No Don't way. I'm here to stop Team Rocket, the only so way I could do that is if I'm literally dropping a tablet from the cockpit ghosts. or something. That's actually kind of scary. Why do you now have legendary, legendary fusions? Wait a minute, Doug. Lucario Reshiram? This man's got a very cool team. That's your best Pokemon, really? Tuck your tail between your legs and scram, Doug. I got bigger fish to fry. No, Doug, do not battle with me. He's got Reshiram and Dark Ride. I'm not sure how to do it. Here you go. Like to see, but that's why we got Remember, point to away from these the things out. Think people have started to nothing. forgive me. Just get this thing out of here. As they switch, you can't even see it, but it looks very cool. No, I'm getting outplayed. We gotta focus in on that level 47 we gotta they might heal off they don't it's down perfect i don't think magnet bomb's gonna do too much here but that's fine oh and it takes it out the perfect hey, Priya, turn have you been what? out in that is the god of whatever is at the bottom of the ocean hi haiku when you're taking on the god of the deep sea over there you bring out the storm clouds let's end this thing let's end it. this battle show news of our victory was spread of this is by others across it's time to take on Sabrina. I've used a lot of Pokemon Why together did you to be say... ready for this moment. Hello, guys. <laughs> Come on. I'm not letting you lure me into a false sense of security. Oh, oh, comes down. What is that thing? Down to two already. The Oxus Reshi Ram. Wait a minute. Look, but you can't touch. It's so glamorous. But you don't have a Hydreigon evil storm cloud following you everywhere. It's only right we end this with a Zekrom fusion. Get this thing out of my sight, Reckoning. Just it's get it out of my embarrassing. sight. Let's just spin I went the to that wheel. spot so specifically so no one would have to be subjected to my nonsense. Whoa. How much did you hear, anyway? There it is. On one hand, oh, I'm excited of it. I, I won't tell anyone. Hand, oh, all of it. I That's great. Terrified. I know the wax What's up, pup? Take too kindly to my poem. Why are you such a crybaby? Real rookie so business. Happy. What was Magic I thinking? I guess you were thinking about love. I'm not exactly the best when it comes to talking about these feelings or whatever. One RDA exec down. How many more to go? Who's baiting who, Kurt? Oh no, let's take on Blaine. I'm ready. How many times Who's baiting who, Kurt? I'll go into the mansion, okay? Gas <laughs> to. Gas to? I thought they were just calling this guy. You want in my lap? Glass? It's like using the power of farts to his advantage. The timing on the Mewtwo spin. You want to get my lap? Come on. Up.
find an Arceus. And once I found Arceus, I was confident I wasn't going to be able to catch a Mewtwo. But here we are. I need to know what this looks like. I just need to know. And there it is! It looks no. like it's got the world in the palm of its hand. This is going to be the absolute perfect fusion for Giovanni. What do you mean they still haven't been back? Looks like we got a little investigating to do. And there they are. Danny came out here alone. No traces of anyone else. Where did she go next? Traveling light. Had rations. A faint scent. But it's there. He only mentioned a topic that he shouldn't have brought up. Yeah. That. Timing couldn't be more off. Talking again about starting a family with your return to Saho. But I saw the unspeakable evil they've done to you. And what they're gonna do to all of us. So, is that why you're out here? Could say that. I cover a lot of ground in a day. Finding vantage points, identifying potential kill boxes, trying to make us safe, if that's possible. Many of our people can't imagine how bad things will get. I can. Ask the trapped wildlife I came across. Couldn't free it without harming it. Where did you find them? Northwest of HQ. I wish there was more I could do. Leave it to me. Yet. 
this. This is the frog god of the underworld. There we go, Haiku. There we go. Ooh. Oh, wait. That's just Mega Blaze again. It's still very cool. But that's just Mega Blaze. Siltina, eh? This is why you're on the team, Don Go. This right here is why you're on the team. Three down. Just one to go. Or we have a chance to take on the champ. Words, Lance. I hope you're ready to back up. Chance in the early game. 
We also have to have our very first battle with the feed, but since I have Shadow Ball on my Noibat, we handle it pretty much as easily as Hawk. After all that, we can move on to Furfield, where we have our very first battle challenge ahead of us, which is Milo. Now, because we have Dragon types, we actually resist Grass, and Okie Dokie even has the Flying type, so we quite resist Grass. Now, in theory, this should make the gym super easy, but Dynamax is always an issue in these fights. Milo's first battle with Gossiper can only really touch us with Grass, but it keeps up with Grass moves, so I can take out with three guns. And Milo's next Pokemon is Eldegoss, which is the real threat of this fight, which he Dynamaxes right away. Now, I have made the executive decision to ban the team for Substitute because it cheeses these Dynamax fights way too much, so I decided just so that Max Overgrowth does a little bit less damage, but it turns out that it's been no damage. In turn, I do a fair amount of damage with the Expert Belt Boosted Gust, and the Max Overgrowth really doesn't do much. I then use it Protect to stall out the final turn of the Max, which means that Eldegoss is going to shoot down to its normal damage. However, at this point, Oki is only at 14 HP, so I decide to swap out into Lab. Wow. I switch, I get hit by a Magical Leaf, and then the next turn I have Lunge, but they really don't do that much damage, and I can set up a work up to do a little bit more damage. The Eldegoss continues to not do very much with the next type moves, and I can take it out with a few more Dragon Claws, and that's going to be it for the very first badge. Not that Milo is going to be a but oh boy, these first stage dragons are not very powerful. We have to fight to get to get a fight, and Beagle goes for Snarl, but we got the soundproof. Sometimes. But since we now have our first badge, we can get our next raid denning game, which happens to be a free game, which is a super late game. Now I say that because it's a really cool Pokemon to have a early game, but it only gets these four moves, and it evolves at level 50. So since we now have another useless member of the team, at least for the time being, I name it Yikes. Yikes. <laughs> it at least has a speed-boosting nature, which means it's going to be the fastest thing on the planet later on. Our next challenge is going to be versus Nessa and her water types. And for this one, I had to come up with a pretty good strategy since we have two useless Pokemon on the team and Noibat is pretty much useless adjacent. So we're going to be using Jang Mo'o to go for bulk up and then alternate with Protect just to get as much leftovers recovery as possible until we get to plus six. Now the only thing that could go wrong here is that Water Pulse could confuse us, but luckily it doesn't and we can take out both Golgi and Aracuda with Dragon Claws. Dynamax Dreadnought hits us with the Max Darkness, but since we have plus six defense and barely does anything and we can hit it with an earthquake but it doesn't quite take it out and the next turn he gets a crit that i survive on two hp fortunately we can follow up the next turn with another earthquake to take it out but if jang Mo would have gone down it would have been bad news bears at this point in the game oh so, well at least it's our second gym badge down and we get our next raid dead encounter which happens to be an axu this time since it's probably our most powerful pokemon at the moment now Rook is a rare aranahe all too keen to speak her mind and quite loudly at that we try and talk her down to no avail. Even the words of the hero, the daughter of the very creatively named Galarmon. The last argument sent the hero turn straight towards the end of Stormblade with Nidos Craig's gay. Oh! <laughs> 
just a few level ups and evolved into an actually usable dragon type Pokemon. Great God of Time, Venus. And with our new team members secured, it's time to take on the Stone Side Gym versus B and her fighting type. And I go ahead and lead off with Flapple and go for Dragon Dance, anticipating a counter here, which he actually does go for. The following turn, I go for yet another Dragon Dance to boost my attack and speed as she goes for Revenge, which does a fair amount of damage. But I decide to go for another Dragon Dance because we haven't consumed our Citrus Berry yet. But after the next Revenge, which admittedly is kind of risky since we go down to 9 HP, we consume the Citrus Berry, which means that Acrobatics is going to be double power and we can just power through these and entire team as strategies go that one was pretty clean and we got to see the raw power of flapple and before we move on have you guys ever noticed that this painting is actually signed who would want to put their name on this garbage daddy way next up we arrive in my favorite pokemon city Valileia. here we can pick up a choice scarf item which we're gonna absolutely need if we want to beat this game and before we can move on to facing the very scary fairy gym we can finally evolve our gen Moo into hakamoo and to be honest this is kind of a double-edged sword since it gains the fighting typing we're now quad week the fairy, so not looking forward to taking those fairy hits. And to be completely honest, I think we would have just lost the run right here if it weren't for the fact that this gym is a weird gimmick gym. Opal starts out with losing, and I decided to go with Hakamoo because, to be honest, it's our best bet. And the first turn, I go for Protect just to burn a turn. This means we get our first question, and since I know the answer, that means we get a plus two speed boost. The following turn, I can go for Sword Stance, and as long as this Weezing doesn't crit, we can survive, and we do on 38. Thank you for these then I go for another protect just to stall for a turn so we might have another question soon, and a metal coat posted iron takes out the wheezing. Then we go with this Mawile, and because of Intimidate, it puts us at only plus one, which is going to be very difficult to knock out the following Pokemon. We do get a defense boost for the next question, but that doesn't matter since any fairy hit would blast us into the next dimension. At this point, I have to go for an earthquake to take out the Mawile, and I'm starting to get worried if we're actually going to be able to win this round because next is Togekiss, and I go for protect, but we don't get the question here.
Danny, the wildlife is safe now. Good. I'm glad you bumped into me. Our little chat reminds me... It's been a while since I talked to anyone about this. About anything on my mind, really. I'm back at HQ, near the entrance. Hello? Please go. Can we... I have some talk more? I'll meet you there. Greetings. It is... Do not just stand there. You will get soaking wet. Couldn't imagine going back to Earth. Mercer is gone, but the RDA it's remains. Not a pretty scene. There is still work to be done. Sure to be Gray and brown as far as the eye can see. Don't remind me. You're back. For now, or? Do I have a choice? I'm trying to keep us safe. Trying to keep my husband safe. Maybe you should talk to him. Tell him what's on your mind. He seems so in love with you. Jin's got so much love in him, it'd be selfish for me to hoard it all to myself. Only makes sense he'd want a family. Back on Earth, I grew up in a harsh place, shaped by people like Mercer. Always people like him. That look in my parents' eyes always stuck with me. A mix of warmth and fear of failing to protect the one thing that mattered the most. Hell, that animal you freed, it'll look after its own one day. And it'll know that pain. I don't think it's thought that far. It's in its nature to produce offspring and protect its young. Like all parents. I guess. <laughs> yeah. Just... Dumb instinct and love. Jin can't imagine me failing. He loves me too much. And I don't know how to tell him... I'm terrified. <laughs> I should talk to him.
much damage since we of course resist it because we're a ground type. I do get poisoned, but my Petra Berry heals it up. Then because of the weak armor, it is faster and hits us with a resistant gunk shot, does get the poison, but we of course seal the victory with another earthquake. And Oleana, I say this for your benefit and everybody around you, get some rest. A moment if I may, does anyone here even remember me? Uh, I'm not really sure who this guy is interrupting our rise to the top, but I guess we'll have to run through him as well. It looks like he has fairy types, and unfortunately we get intimidated here on Ooh, but I can set up the reflect so the play rough doesn't really do that much damage. I then go ahead and set up two sword stances before setting up a light screen. This is going to be really important since Rapidash outspeeds us and hits us on the special side of things, but one Iron Head takes out this Maul out, the next one takes out the Gardevoir, which can't outspeed us. Then it's time for Rapidash, and I'm hoping we can take this Dazzling Gleam, and we actually live on 8 HP, and I destroy it with an Iron Head. Then we take out Hatterene with another Iron Head, since it only has base 30 speed, and we can finally get back to our regularly scheduled tournament. Who is this guy? Anyway, next up is Nessa, our first gym leader opponent who starts out with Golisopod, so I lead with Lau. The first turn, I hit Golisopod with a Thunder Punch to get it below half health and send it out with Emergency Exit, sending in Pelipper and the Rain, which obviously gets destroyed right away. Then comes Barrasquita, which has the Ice Fang and actually gets the Flinch the first turn, but the next turn, it doesn't get the Flinch or the Freeze, which could have been kind of scary, and ended the run right here. We then take it out with a Thunder Punch, and we could do the same to Golisopod, but I take the time to set up a sword stance since it can't hit us very hard. Then the rain stops, so it literally can't hit us for much at all at this point, so I go for another sword stance to get to plus four, and Shadow Claw leaves us at 28 HP. I then go ahead and take out the Golisopod with a Thunder Punch, and next up is Seeking, which gets the exact same treatment. Bye-bye, Fishy. Finally, he's Dreadnought, but since we have plus four close combat, it isn't exactly a fair fight. Sorry, Nessa, but you're gonna have to move out of the way to the top, because next up, we're fighting B and her fighting types. And in this fight, I pretty much decided to bring the weakest guys on the squad because I was getting kind of high level and this thing could only hit us with bounce anyway. I do miss the Will-O-Wisp the first turn, so I take kind of a lot of damage from the first one. I do, however, have the Leftovers, which is going to be super helpful if we get hit by a crit bounce here, but I go for a Willow to burn it, which means it's going to do very little damage. And in the turns in between while it's in the air, I decide to go for Dragon Dances to get to plus six. However, on the 6th Dragon Dance, I get hit by a crit bounce, which leaves me at 18 HP. That's pretty scary, but the next turn, we can just baton pass our boosts over to what the heck. And what the heck is probably exactly what B said when she got destroyed by this thing. I mean, what's Drake Assault even supposed to be? Whatever it is, it's pretty disturbing at the least. But once we beat B, we leveled up during the fight with Dino, which means it evolves into a Zwilus. Which doesn't evolve until 64, and it's pretty much unusable, so... Okay, now let's talk about Ryan. In the previous fight, we totally humiliated him, but this time, it kind of went the other way. I'm gonna be honest. We'll get to that, though. First, I go for a Dragon Dance, as Torkoal goes for Yawn, which isn't gonna be a problem. The next turn, I go for a Dragon Dance once again. We then get hit by a Lava Plume, which doesn't get the burn, but we fall asleep from Yawn and heal it off with a Chesto Berry. I then go for yet another Dragon Dance to boost my stats a bit more, as Torkoal goes for a Lava Plume, which does burn me this time. However, it's really not the end of the world, since I can just pass my boosts over to Kingdra, which 